I don't have much going on in my room right now. I literally have my table, which is awesome, by the way. It's a standing desk. I can push a button and it goes up. Ah! Ah! So this person said they put a lot of effort into this. This is called a vision laser by Oswald Overd. A vision laser. Okay. Cool, man. Oops. Oh, man, that one, that part is a little weird. I mean, so far it looks pretty cool, though. Although some of the spikes don't really match the blocks. Like, they're coming, they're falling off. Like, you can see the lines don't match. Gameplay has been a little weird. Oof. No, I don't like those things phasing in, you know? You got to do, like, like a lot of those, like, mid-dash herbs. I feel like there's a lot of similar gameplay. And that, that was kind of like a weird transition, too, you know? Um, so far, like, the gameplay hasn't been that enjoyable, is uh, my big criticism of the level. And some of the lines don't match up. So I don't know if I'm even going to send this for a star rate. Um, it just, it needs some polishing, you know? The block design's, like, protruding outside of the blocks. And I'm not too sure if it was intentional, but it looks, like, really weird. So I will say this level certainly could go for some polishing and some variation. I mean, it's been almost the, like, the exact same looking the whole way. I mean, I will say this, though, like these creators came together and this could be their first ever mega collab they've been associated with or first ever like like level in general. Right. And I got to say, like, you know, for a beginner in the level editor, though, if these people are, I mean, this is like, it's really good. You know, um, I will not be sending it, though. I mean, yeah, here we go. The Nyan Cat, unfortunately, like blocks some of the gameplay though which is really annoying me and cat yeah 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 out of my way oh yeah and the, like parts like this are kind of empty right Adieu! okay i'm done this level has a lot of potential i really wish you guys the best of luck uh maybe make another mega collab try to try for a little bit of variation in the level um there's a lot of parts that look samey and some of the gameplay parts were pretty annoying and very very unbalanced also work on that music sync a little bit yeah glow -oy dreams I mean, that looks good. That looks cool. Nice. I, I like that effect. There were parts that looked a little messy, though. I mean, yeah, this is uh, what some people might call uh, kind of generic. But so far, the game has been or the gameplay has been good. Music sync is good. Got to hit the switch. Oops, but don't don't hold down the button. Nice. That was, that was a bit cheeky. Okay, kind of short. Nice. That was that was some good music sync. Hmm. Dude, I love the way this part looks. Yeah, that looks cool, dude. But it just happened at the very end. The melting spikes was cool. The rest of it was. I don't want to say generic. I hate using that word, generic. And it was a little, it was empty, you know? The ending was insanely good. I 100% I agree. So I'll send it for like a five-star star rate. At this point, it's become a meme that mods are incredibly picky. The thing is, multis, is there's like 100 mods, 100 plus mods now. A lot of levels get sent to Rob Top. He doesn't have time to go through a lot. We, we have to be picky, you know? Because unfortunately, just as the community has gotten better at making levels, like the standards have risen, you know, that's no secret. Painful memories by E Creepy. Sometimes these dreadful things to the past resurface only to torment you. Can you handle them or not? I don't think it's going to be a pretty dark level. Painful memories. Hmm. Oh, I like that. Oh, it just shows your icon, but you're not actually like spinning. It's like kind of a dash orb. But it's not. You didn't have to hold down the button. That's cool. So you hit those. I mean, I do. I'm into that gameplay. That's fun. Oh, it's really dark now. Yeah. I mean, I will say I do like this whole theme. This kind of like depressing. This theme of depression. And it, the song goes really well to it. That looks nice. Uh, I'm into it. It's like a nice, easy level. Boring gameplay. I mean, it's it's an easy level, though. Like, it's a non-demon. Although, you know, there's quite a lot of nothing at, like, some parts. I do like the artistic value of this level. Like, I think it's solid. 
Like, I love the way that darkness looks. And it is a little samey. Like, it's unique. It's unique. Hmm. I'm going to send it for a star rate for sure. Um, it just doesn't have quite enough polish to get a feature, I don't think. This is called Dysnomia by David Gamer. Host by David. Created by David Gamer and more. Verified by Slash Homie. Reverified by Victor Senpai. This is supposed to be Demon. I'm not too sure how hard it is. I am not good at Geom Dredge in the morning. Okay, it's not too bad. Oh, dude, that, that looks cool, man. I, I like the way that looks a lot. I'm pretty hard, though. Wow. I think this is going to be extreme demon difficulty. Yeah. I think I'd be better off just finding a video for it on YouTube. <laughs> uh, Disnome 100% Extreme Demon by David Gamer and more. <laughs> yeah, the, it's pretty low quality recording. I mean, not everyone... Jeez, geez, that, that death sound is just the weirdest thing in the whole world. Oh, this guy's playing in low detail, too, isn't he? Oh, yo, 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 okay. Well, there's a full detail mode with no clip right here. This is full detail. But it's in 720p 30 FPS. Are you kidding me? Like, there's free software that records at 1080p. Come on. Like, OBS is 100% free. This looks way better. Yeah. Yeah, I think if you're going to verify level, you should verify level in high detail for sure. It, do it does look nicer for sure. Yeah. No, I like the way that looks. Harder insane demon, are you crazy? It's it's extreme. It's I don't think it's list extreme, but it's extreme. Yeah, that looks cool. Love that. I love the way that looks in high detail mode. That swing copter part looked interesting. That looked really hard. Hmm. Interesting. Cool. It, it, it does have... Uh, I, I mean, it's hard to say if it has inconsistent difficulty or not, unless you actually play it. Like, some parts can look hard. Uh, Dysnomia, I think, is a really cool-looking level. I'll send it for future, yeah. Looks good. I like it. I would love to see a level verified in high detail with a nice recording, you know? And I know not everyone has the means to a good computer, but, like... It's hard for me to discern if a level's good or not uh, with like a recording of that low quality. That recording was yikes, you know. Irrelevance by Azmuth. One could drown in irrelevance. That's like a YouTuber's fear. Thanks for the donation, dude. Oof, okay. Cool, I mean, it looks like a decent modern level so far. Dude, why do you die there though? What? Ah! I, you can't, I can't make it! Oh, dude, I see. There's like a, a portal, a cheeky portal that comes up. You can't just like cheese it. You gotta like go where the arrows tell you. I got it! I understand! Man. <laughs> Why are some parts ridiculously hard? Okay. What? Like, I'm, I'm buffering my input there. You, man, you gotta jump so early. What is, dude? Oh, that was so hard. I mean, I like this way this level looks. I think it's good. Oh, you just fall. What am I doing? Because, like, for, for the level's difficulty, some of these parts where you gotta, like, buffer your input super early or, uh, or do some things is, like, it's, it's too much, man. It's, it's too much. Or at least, like, some indicators. Like, I do, I love the way this aesthetic looks. Like, this part looks really good right here. And there's some parts, other parts in the level that look incredibly good, too. Some parts were, whoa, some parts were crazy hard. I also don't like that, how, like, you got to follow the arrows to make a portal appear. Like, I understand if you use a switch or something, like something visual. I mean, I guess the arrows are visual, but I don't know. I'm not a big fan of that. And then there's this, which is like, 
you need to buffer your input. Like, what you need to do is jump as early as possible and then buffer your input there. So anyways, the block design changes, then the block design changes again here. Um, so there's nice, like, variation in the way the level looks, but it retains that same uh, design style. Like, the colors and the way the effects work. Like, everything just comes together really nicely. And there's enough variation to make it look, like, fun and interesting. So, yeah, this level this level's good. It's, it's a really solid level. And then this part happens and this part looks awesome, right? Yeah, it's it's got a lot of polish to it and the level changes a lot. All right, nice. Dude, awesome. That's very good. The gameplay's fine. The gameplay's fine. It's like a seven star. It's like a seven star feature. It's easy on mobile. Well, yeah, I guess it's a 240 hertz thing then. But still, I mean, a lot of people play on 240 hertz. So I guess I just found a bug for you. <laughs> Just, just remove the spike. It's, it's chill. Because if you remove the spike or make it smaller, you still have to jump, right? Like, because there's an edge. Something should change there just a little bit. Only that's why. I think it deserves a feature. 100% I'm going to send it for a feature. I request that you change that one part for 240 hertz people. That's it. Maybe I should send it for an 8 star because there are some timings. Okay, I can send it for an 8 star. I mean, I, I got gotcha. you. Because what's happening, I think, is I'm jumping too far above the orb or below, I guess, the orb. And I'm not able to buffer properly. Yeah. Okay. Send it for eight star. Very, very cool. Azimuth. Yeah. I really, really enjoyed it. Wolsey is my pen pal. Simple, but one of my best. Dedicated to Dan's woman. Wolsey is my pen pal. This is a very Moffer style name. Dude, Moffer names are awesome. Oh. Oh, there's you writing the pen pal to Wolsey. Okay. <laughs> the, the stamp on the letter going to uh, Wolsey. Okay. I mean, that's, that's funny. The actual uh, level itself is a, it's a little bit bland and empty. A little bit. It could... And the rays of light look a little weird. I don't think I'm going to send it, but I do... Like, I think it's a funny level. And yeah, this part is a little boring. <laughs> Woolsey! Whoa. That's it. Uh, it's, I mean, it's funny, but I'm not going to send it. But it's it's funny. I mean, I appreciate that. <laughs> oh, my God. Trex EXE by Matthew Game. Escape from the router's death grip and destroy it to pieces. That sounds cool. Oh, dude. Two-player level. Ooh. And, wow. Wow. Look at that! Dude! Whoa, man! RTX on. Uh, yeah! That's insanely good! Oh. Now I'm a ship. I mean, it's a little laggy. We gotta destroy the router. <laughs> what? I have destroyed all your RAM. Now it's your turn to die. Destroy it. Oh, am I just supposed to spam? Oh, oh, I shoot with that. And then I reload. Okay, you, now it's two player. You shoot with the up. I'm shooting with up. I'm probably going to die. Wi-Fi destroyed. <laughs> Dude, man, that's wow. That's awesome. Four star feature. Yeah, maybe it's a little too laggy for Epic Feature. I'll leave that in the hands of Rob Top for sure. But like, holy shoot, dude. This one, I was not on the fence at all. Nemugen Vortex. Happy New Year. This is another one of those levels where I think like that looks cool, but it's very static, right? Why am I might not in practice mode? This wave, uh, that, that. That ship part was pretty cool. Like that, man, I love the way the blocks look there. Like I said, that looks just really static, though. Yeah, and this part looks cool. Now now we got a little bit of... A little get a bit of movement. And now we got the nod to the circles part, yeah. Oh, yeah, dude, I, li I like the way that looks, yeah. Because in, like, the dual wave, there could be a little bit of variation there, you know? Like, a little bit of creativity with the wave gameplay. 
I think. Oh wow, how did I miss that speed change? Oh, four times is too hardcore for me. Yeah, there's a lot of this, you know, da 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 da, up and down, dual. Uh, 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 you know what I mean? Dude, I think the block design looks great here. This part just looks like so static. Dude, there's so many cool looking parts in this level. I'll, I'll send it for a rate, which means it's probably not going to get rated. <laughs> Gameplay in the wave part's too boring. There are parts that look good, but there's also parts that don't. I think the best part is the ship and the ball and the end cube. There's a little too much going on with like the kind of strobing with the arrows and uh, the gameplay is just a little boring, right? This level has insane potential and I'm going to heart it. Anyways, yeah, I, I have so many levels today. There's no way I can get to all your levels. I apologize. There's like, I get <coughs> hundreds of requests a day. Hundreds. Uh, I'll see you on YouTube, right? <laughs> As always. Peace.